What's up, fam? How you doing? Um, just sitting here getting ready to do my hair. Um, I got to go out and run some errands. I just want to show you guys one of my favorite hairstyles that I'm always rocking. Um, I know you've probably seen these, this particular hairstyle, you know, on YouTube. A lot of people are doing this hairstyle. It's called a twist. And it's very simple and easy. That's probably why it's one of my favorite hairstyles. Um, I noticed that I haven't been doing a lot of tutorial on um, hairstyles. Well, this is just one of my hairstyles that I like to rock. Um, I have this hair product that I'm using. I know a lot of you guys are gonna say, oh, don't put that crap on your hair. That is petroleum. And I know it has all the bad ingredients in it. It has petroleum. Uh, it doesn't say it has mineral oil, but I'm pretty sure it does have it in here. But it doesn't have mineral oil, just a petroleum fragrance and coconut oil. Um, out of all the hair products that I buy, especially the expensive ones, it still leaves my hair dry for like a couple of days besides my shea butter. And I don't have any more shea butter. I'm not working. I'm in school full time. And I just don't have the funds. I got used to have the funds to buy these products. So I bought this particular one from the beauty supply store, I think for $2.99 or $2.49. And I had to do it old school because I remember my grandmother used to put this in my hair when I was little and my hair was natural and my hair was like almost to my waist. Okay, here it goes. I know you guys gonna be upset with me about this, but blue magic, bam. Coconut oil. Do not sleep on this. When I be using the other products, it leaves my hair dry for two days, like I said before. By the time I want to comb it out and and um, get ready to wash it, it be hair all over the floor. It be hair all in my comb. It be hair all over my clothes. I can touch it and I can have hair in my hands. I mean, this right here, it, it, to me, it moisturized my hair. A lot of you all might say, that don't moisturize your hair. That's just product sitting on top of your hair. Well, to me, it feels like it's moisturized, especially on my ends. But I don't put this on my scalp. This is what I don't put on my scalp. I just put it on my hair and my ends. And I only put a little bit. And it leaves my twists feeling nice and not greasy because I'm not heavy-handed and I don't put a lot on my hair. I washed it last night with my Old John shampoo. And um, I put my Old John conditioner in it and my Old John leave-in leave treatment. So. And I don't know, but I know for one thing, this grease, I know it's grease and it's not all that great, but it do not leave. I don't have a lot of hair on the floor. And I only use a little bit of this grease, the coconut oil. But like I said, the ingredients, it just says petroleum. That's the first ingredient. Um, cocoa something and coconut oil and fragrance. So I only get like a little bit. Like just that little bit. And I put it on the section where I'm going to do my twist. If you hear a bell in the background, I have a new cat, a new kitten. I've had him for like three weeks now, and I have a, a, an adult cat. His name is Mr. Noodles, and they're not getting along. Three weeks, and they're still not getting along. He's a male, and this little kitty down here is a male also. His name is Fanta, my son called him Fanta, because he's orange like the orange soda. See, he's getting into stuff. This is him. Say hi, YouTubers. Okay, now say bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Bye, okay, say bye.
This is dry hair. I don't have anything on it. Very dry. See? No string of hair. And I wish I could bring the camera down so you can look on the floor. There's no hair on the floor. Trust me. I'm not making it up. There's no hair on the floor. And then I get a little bit more. Because I don't like to feel my hair greasy. I don't like that greasy feeling and that greasy look. And I just put it on my ends. Gotta get, I have to show you guys an update on my nails. My nails are just growing wildly from the vitamins that I am taking. I'm almost finished with those rainbow light vitamins. I'm not gonna, after I finish this rainbow light bottle, I'm not gonna buy any more prenatal vitamins. I'm just gonna buy the multivitamins by rainbow light. And see, it leaves my twist not greasy looking. And here's my nails. I have acrylic over them because I want to see how long my nails get and I don't want them to break. But this is my thumbnail. And I had did this, these two designs and I don't want to take them off. So I took the polish off of all of them and kept the design, but these are my nails. And this thumb is really short. When I put the acrylic over it, and now that my real nail is growing over the, the acrylic. Next week, I'm going to a wedding. So I will do a video on me blowing out my hair again for the second time. Yeah, guys, don't sleep on the blue magic. I mean, I didn't have a problem with it when I was a little girl. My hair kept growing and growing and growing. My grandmother, she's a um, she's a Seminole Indian, and she's mixed with the Seminole Indian and um, African. And she has a lot of hair, and that was the only thing that I knew when I was little was Blue Magic. She bought, she always bought the blue kind. Um, Sometimes she would buy the green kind. I don't know what's the difference, but she always kept the blue grease from Blue Magic. I don't know if it's because it's called Blue Magic and she preferred to be blue, I don't know. But that was the only grease that I knew and that was what I grew up using. Still, no hair. I mean, you can really see the texture of my hair. My hair is very dry and brittle. Get down. You want grease on your hair too? And I only use a little bit, like I said. And these are just jumbo twists. I tried so hard. I bought some Nourish and Shine by Jane Carter from Target for $22. And I tried so hard to like that product on my hair. I love it on my skin. But it just left my hair really dry. And the thing about it, 
I'm forcing my hair to like this. Oh, you gotta like this. You gotta act right. I paid $22 for this. It's like I'm forcing my hair to like something because I paid a lot of money that I think that was a lot of money pricey for me, for my pockets. And I don't want to throw it away and I don't want to give it away. So I'm going to force it on my hair and make it like it. But, you know, sometimes you got to listen to what your hair is trying to tell you. My hair didn't like that. My hair like this crap. I like this fucking crap right here. I don't know why it does, but it works well on my hair. It keeps it moisturized and I mean, it's just, I've been using this for a while since I've been on YouTube. I was just too ashamed to show this as one of my staple products because um, everybody's so down on the petroleum. But I've had this for a long time. I just didn't ever want to show it on YouTube. But I, I'm showing it now. But it has been making my hair. It, it, it's really, I don't know if you've seen my other videos from last year, December. My little twist was really right here. I don't know if that petroleum is making my hair grow. But all I know is that I don't have no hair on the floor. And um, I still have my other butters that I'm going to keep using because I don't want to throw it away. And um, I probably might end up giving it away. I still use my Darcy's Botanical. Um, at a cast out vanilla styling cream when I'm when I'm doing my braids or when I'm doing my daughter's braids that works good on her hair. Um, the butters work good on my son's hair because he have long locks, and it works good on my husband's hair because he have locks. So I can just rub it in his their hair, rub it in their locks, and it, it just blends right on in their locks. But No, my hair likes this the crack. The 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 junk. See? No hair on my hands, no hair on my shoulders. So I'll be back for the finish deal. Peace. I'm back. Um finished with twisting up my hair. And like I said, these are big um Jumbo twist. Now I know I said that I can't find any um, natural hair products like hair butters besides my own butter that I make that moisturize my hair very well. I forgot to mention I did use one product that moisturized my hair pretty good and that was Kemet Biologic, um, the heavy olive oil cream or something like that that's pretty good that moisturized my hair pretty good I would probably end up buying that again but right now I'm gonna stick with my blue magic so y'all can say what y'all want to say about the blue magic all I can just say is don't sleep on it now yesterday I shampooed my hair like I said and um put it in like four big twists really didn't comb it out that good but um i took my time today and comb out my hair to put it in some twists let me show you how much hair um came out like i said before when i used the other butters um i have a lot of hair that come out this is all the hair that came out whoa And this is from me combing my hair dry. So that's all the hair that came out today. Comb my hair dry, putting these twists in it. Now, I don't have any rubber bands or ouchless bands or anything like that. Um, only bands, only, only thing that I put in my hair when I want to wear it back is 
I like these. This is um, a leather barrette that I ordered off Etsy. This is cool. This is what I like. I like these type of things in my hair. These leather barrettes with the wooden stick in my hair. I don't like rubber bands. Um, here's another one I found at the beauty supply store for 99 cents. This is another one. I mean, if I can find a person who sell this locally, I would have a draw for these things. And I have these um, ouchless big jumbo barrettes and I have two small ones. And I have some hair sticks. This is a black one and I have a dark brown one that I got from Sally's. So I like my hair sticks. But today, like I said, I have some errands to run. So I'm gonna show you how I usually wear my um, twist. I don't wear it like this. Let me take my glasses off. So I don't wear it out looking like this. This is how I wear it. I always make sure I have a part, a straight part on the side. The other parts, I don't care. I part them ran, ran with my fingernail on my fingers. And I always like to have my ponytail on the side. Get it in there, I got so much hair. Okay, so this is what I wear on the side, and then what I do, I get my hair pins, if you hear some music in the background, that's my cell phone going off. It's nobody but my brother, he always calling me, talking about nothing. He lives in California. And I just try to do this standing up. Put that in. The bobby pins. And I tuck this short piece in with the body pin. And let me show you my headbands. Um, this is it. I hope you guys can see it because I have no idea about how the back looks. But this is how I usually wear my favorite style, like this. Um, I do a lot of crochet. Oh, and I forgot to show you, I have this clip also I like to put on my hair. I probably might wear this when I go to the wedding next week. But I have this piece here and what I do, I get a, a band and I crochet this and um, I stick it through here. And I wear it like this on my head. 
Then I have another piece and I stick it through the hole in the middle and I also wear it like this, you know, as a headband, bring it down. I'm gonna wear it as a headband. And I have this little piece of flower here. Um, and I just stick it through the headband and I wear it as a band. But yeah, this is one of my styles that I like. Let me go in the sun so you can see it better. It might be too sunny, but this is what the style looks like. One of my favorite styles that I'm always wearing. Then I have another style that I like to wear also. And I will show you that another time. But until then, peace and please subscribe. Thanks.